The situation, the humanitarian situation is indeed dire for the people who have been uh, displaced by the fighting. You need to normalize the situation along the border between South Sudan and the Republic of Sudan. And those two states, Southern Kurdufan and Blue Nile, sit right on the border between the two countries. If there is turmoil, if there is fighting, then you do not need a lot of imagination to understand that it will eventually uh, impact in an adverse fashion on, on the relations between the Republic of Sudan and South Sudan. And it is unthinkable that there can be normal relations between the two states uh, if there is a fighting raging just across the border from South Sudan. Are you satisfied with the oil deal? Obviously a deal on oil has been agreed, but it's a tentative deal in the sense that uh, its actual implementation remains contingent on agreement on other outstanding issues, notably uh, the border demarcation, uh, the status of the contested areas and the claimed border areas, as well as the referendum on, on ABA. People still talk about sharing oil revenue. I mean, sharing oil revenue is a misnomer. Such, no such thing exists because we are now two separate countries and the resources in our territory belong to us. The resources of the Republic of Sudan belong to the, to the, to the Sudanese people. So there's no question of sharing. What we have been willing all along to do is to pay a reasonable cost for the right to transport our oil through the Republic of Sudan, and, and, and we have offered that. Susan Rice says that the Security Council is going to hold your feet to the fire if an agreement isn't reached. They're threatening sanctions. What is the international pressure like during these negotiations? Well, you don't need to get the Republic of South Sudan really to do anything. You're, you're basically, in the case of South Sudan, pushing an open door. Uh, it's the other side that uh, needs pressure to be brought to bear on them. And I would hope that uh, the international community, and in particular the United States and, and China, uh, would apply themselves with the same degree of vigor and zeal to persuading Khartoum uh, to, 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 to move on the other outstanding issues in the same manner in which they have applied pressure for Khartoum to accept uh, the deal on oil.